What's up, fam? Hey, thank y'all for tuning in once again. As always, be sure to like, share, comment, and subscribe. And when you subscribe, hit the notification bell so every time I drop a video, you will be the first to know about it. If you don't know by now, you saw that the Roe versus Wade decision has been overturned by the Supreme Court. So basically, they're allowing the states to make a limited amount of choices when it comes to who can be able to do the procedure to pretty much end the life. End the life. Supreme Court said they're not doing it no more. Which I personally agree that should be the case. Now, do I think it should be legal or illegal? That's what it is. I don't feel that the court system should have say so of what you do with your body. You see, well, I said, yeah, I'm like this. I'm the type of person. I'm like this. Sir. You do what you do, and you, uh, you know, you deal with the, 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 the consequences. Now, I understand there are many reasons why people feel that it is that it's necessary to be able to be able to do this to do what they to do what they federally outlaw you may have situations where a lady a child a woman is violated you know forced to or for an act is forced violently or viciously or incoherently whatever the case may be whether she's like say she's being overpowered physically or overpowered with the use of some kind of medication and they're unable to defend themselves which and a a life is produced i can understand the thinking of okay because it's a whole psychological thing and this is why i think a lot of times the uh the uh religious why people are going against religion a lot of people because they're because Another way we're taught, you know what I'm saying, in the Christian church or what have you. And, and, and you know what I'm saying, amongst you know, our people, it's all about feel good. It's all about grace. It's all about blessing. It's all about it's going to be a better day. You know, all, all the hymnals are being sung. You know, you know, nobody's really being told any longer what can happen if you choose to do certain things or what it You know, it's, it's all black and white. But then when something like what I just described, happens no one has a biblical answer that makes sense at that time when it happens to them it's easy for me or anyone else like let me say men because i don't know how women you know i'm just say men but it's easy for us to tell a woman what she can and can't do because it's not us i mean but that's with anything, I mean, if, if if somebody's going through anything, any you know, and they come to advice to the person that's not going through it, hasn't been through it, you know, it's simple for somebody to say, "Well, you should do this," or "Well, you should do that." It's kind of like how people try to tell you how to raise your kids, and they never had a child, but they write books and write laws where you can't punish, can't spank your children, and if your children feel threatened or scared, they can cause you no know, child protective custody, so child protective services on you. And you're like, what the hell done happened in the last 30, 30, 40 years? Same thing. So you got, so like I said, it's easy for me to sit there and tell a woman what she, what she should and shouldn't do, but I'm not in her head in a situation like that. So again, like I said, if you have no control of what, uh, of what happened to where you had to procreate, then I would say, I would, you know what I'm saying? You would have the right to make the choice you want to make. Because again, psychologically, no matter what choice you make, I can tell you this, no matter what choice you make, psychologically, it's going, you're, going, you're damaged. You, you are damaged and you're going to be damaged. And you will need counseling either way, either choice you make, period. Because you think about women who can have kids or who try to conceive kids and they have miscarriages. Psychologically, they are damaged. They need counseling. A lot of them, I'm going to say all of them, Cause I've you know I've seen women who 
used to happen and it just it especially depends on what is a trimester or, or what stage that the, that the baby is how, how 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 grown that baby is in the belly like if it's maybe the first couple of months you know it may not be as i mean i don't know you know i would assume it's not as bad but you get to like seven eight nine months and you know you don't got woman got huge and she can feel a baby kick and you know and rolling you know, and she really, and she's anticipating it. And then something tragic happens by, I know that I, that cannot sit well in a woman's psyche. So I would assume or suggest, you know, it would be behoove them, it would behoove, it would behoove them to get counseling of some kind because that cannot be an easy thing and I know dads you know they can't they're not they can't carry the child but you know they're anticipating this too and you know and it hurts them too so it seems like you know everybody needs some kind of therapy but in situations where I feel that you are anywhere from 50 to 100 you can't be 100% 50 to well you can't be 100% no you can't 50 to, I'm going to say, 95% have part of a, the consensual act that you consented to this act at least 50, well, you know what I'm saying, that you are part of the, that you and somebody else can consented to this act equally or you wanted this act more than the guy if a child is produced, I feel you got to deal with it because that's a choice. Now you might say, "Hey, what if I'm dealing with a guy and then we get pregnant? You know, I get pregnant and come, you know, he's beating on me, being abusive, this and the third. And I don't want to be with him, so now I want to get rid of the child." You know, well, unfortunately, like every any, anything else that you do, and you have to suffer the consequences. Because, you know, a child's supposed to be a blessing. A blessing to the parents that have them. And they are, if you know how to properly raise and how to care for a, 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 a child. But if you and a dad, something happens, because there's people that have, you know, get pregnant with guys that they love and married and this and the third, and, and the guy ends up die, dead or going to jail. And these people don't think of, you know what I'm saying, doing this uh, Roe versus Wade act. They, you know, they keep the baby and raise them and everything because you know it's what you know, it's, it, you know, it's what they want. It's the right, you know, it's, it's the reminder of that person. So I mean, but then again, like I said on that flip, if the guy's abusive, they said in the third and y'all had that baby, then you, they say they don't want to have it because of reminding that person. But my thing is, as an adult, you have to be courting. That's why, like in a lot of my videos, I, I try to push courting nowadays. You know, y'all, you get to know somebody, somebody, and you vet that person. And you meet that person's family and vice versa. And then y'all show what y'all can bring to each other. And you let it be a process before you choose to marry and to have babies. Now, no way, shape, or form will I say that I did anything perfectly. You know, because my first child was not conceived while me and her mother was married we eventually got married and stayed married and had another you know had another child but if i could teach us which is what you're supposed to do when you get older you're supposed to get wiser and teach the younger ones what not to do or what they should do that's that's your job i would tell kid i would tell people if i could go back and do it over again i would have waited till i was probably 30 before I had my first child, I still have my same two kids, but I would wait it just a little longer because that way I could have got, made sure I got my life right, my finances right. You know, uh, if I was married or dating or courting or whatever, I could, you know, travel, see the world, learn, see the countries, you know, learn ourselves, grow together, and then when we, felt that it was time well there's never a perfect time to do it but we would increase our chance of success you know as a family to to to, to remain a family 
if we, you know, I feel if you're more grounded. But like I said, I didn't, but you know, that's what, like I said, looking back, that's what I would have done. But again, you make choices and you have to live the choice. So if you plan on having a hot girl summer and you mess around and lay down with a guy that you don't know, or you're dealing with guys that you know got nine baby mamas and 13 kids, 15 kids, 20 kids. And I don't want to hear nothing about, oh, I didn't know he didn't have no kid. But again, because if you take time out, I know a young lady who dated this guy, was dating this guy, feel good about him. And then, but you know, it's a process. Eventually it came out that this guy had a child. You know, that was a shock, but I guess they may have, you know, this young lady may have kind of was like, okay, maybe I can deal with that. You know, he tried to explain why he got a child. Then one day he come out and said that, you know, it's taking a long time to get a divorce. And they was like, what? A divorce? You're married? Say, oh yeah, yeah, but we didn't separate, you know, for two years. See, those are two things, regardless of which, how you have you want to, how you want to put it, those are two things that need to be brought out in the beginning. But again, your court and your date over time, eventually people, gonna have, you know, they can't hide everything. People try to hide stuff because they're trying to get what they want to get in the beginning. And then after they get what they want, then they may come out, you know, and tell you start, you know, start telling you stuff. And thinking you ain't gonna go nowhere. But anyway, back to this. Again, like I said, you're trying to have a hot girl summer and you messing with dudes that, you know, you shouldn't be laying down with or you are, or even, you know, or, or, or even dating people that you know that, like I say, ain't doing nothing, ain't not doing nothing constructive to society, not a constructive uh, individual. There's no need for you to be laying down with that person. You gotta learn how to curb your urges. Curb your urges. Find something else to do. Find another hobby, hobby besides just laying down and when in, 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 in everybody. Because you can't trust everybody and everybody can't trust you. You know, so you can sit there and say, oh, I thought we was just down the third and we loved each other so much. No, you were just, you were just hot and horny. That's all it was. Once that was over with, now you're looking back like, damn, kind of messed up on that one. Now, uh oh, now I'm gonna have a baby. Like, saw the, saw the story, and everybody not supposed to, shouldn't be parents. Like, I saw the, the, the video where the young girl was in the delivery room or the hospital room with two guys, and both guys were there trying to see who's the daddy. It's like, who does that? You know, that's, I mean, everybody, if anybody need to do rope anyway, no, no. But I mean, everybody don't need to be parents. That's what I'm saying. You gotta, if we gotta learn, we gotta be taught. And then we got to teach those coming under us. And I mean, starting at the, like age four, five, six years old, because that's when they start the real, the curiosity really kicks in. And they not only are they watching, now they can act and respond to what they see. And so we really need to start teaching our youngins at an early age about sex and kids and you know, and families and and consequences and all this kind of stuff. Even if they don't understand it, but you gotta put it in their brain. So when they get older and understand it, they uh, know how to react to it. So personally, what I think about this, I mean, it started off, off of a lie and it, it was created for, for off of a lie anyway. So. I think no two ways about that part, but uh, it is, I mean, it is what it is. But truthfully, I'm a, I'm a pipe person that, let's say, hey, if you do something, you gotta deal with it, period. If somebody go and ride with a guy to go rob a store or to rob a guy for his weed and the guy ends up dead, somebody ends up dead, the guy that's rolling with him, if you knew, what the consequences of what, what could happen if you go and try to rob this guy. You know, even if you go and try to do, shoot, even, if, I mean, a crime is even just going and just, you know, selling drugs and buying drugs. That's illegal. So, you know, somebody, something happened and you get caught. You can't be there and saying, hey, I was in the seat, but I didn't know what was going, I didn't know all this was going to happen. The first thing them laws going to tell you is that you was doing something illegal. So it really doesn't matter. You knew what you were doing wasn't right. So you shouldn't have been doing you shouldn't have been doing it. So you gotta deal with the consequences. But anyway, there's been a lot of protests. You know it's gonna be a lot of protests. 
you know, you kind of wonder why people protest one way or another and every, everybody act like everything is black and white. But there always got to be a gray area somewhere, especially with these laws, because laws, you know, they change overnight for, for anything. So it's not like, you know, there's something big and, you know, something that probably won't be appealed and brought back and appealed and taken out and, and going back and forth. It's just, it's just a cycle. My thing is stuff like this, Truthfully, you really shouldn't be involved in nothing like this. If you're doing what you need to do, like I said, now for the most of it, not those like I said who in certain circumstances, like maybe there's uh during the pregnancy, like you know, that there's a there's a high probability that the mother may 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 pass. Then okay, now you gotta make the choice of you know what to do. Or the high probability that the, that the child may pass, or the child may have some kind of deformation that is like I don't know three legs six feet no no eight hands four arms then it's like what do you okay if that's what you want to do hell I really it's like damn I can't I can't really get religious on you on that one I, I don't know what to tell you you know because I can't be holding out holier than now on that one Shit, that, that's that's I'm gonna I'm 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 leave that one up to you and whichever, whatever you choose to do, I, I, I'm, I'm fine with it. You know, regardless if I like it or not, I can understand that. But again, like I said, if you out here doing things, you know, it's the summertime and it's hot. Going to be a lot of pool parties, a lot of women out here and men too. Well, women going to be out here dressing in the, in the least, you no know, amount of clothes. Men will probably be out here walking around in, you know, tank tops and shorts with the pants hanging down below their belt for whatever hell reason. You know, flexing. You know, women gonna be showing curves and you know skin and stuff. I mean, it's gonna be some hormones raging, but again, you better control that. Cause if not, you're gonna be out down there protesting with the rest of these people in you know, Washington D.C. trying to get this law back. And per like me, I don't think the law should be in everybody's business. Sometimes, sometimes you gotta tell people what to do. Wrong folks too, but something like this, if you if you're able to control it control yourself because because if not you have to deal the consequences period but anyway tell me what you think about this leave your comments below and then share it with the world and as always i'll leave you in peace and i'll see you on the other side